And I think the big question that a lot of people are going to want to know know is video games especially with football um i think that was specifically called out in some articles i saw where it's like and sorry guys if i'm getting the name wrong in ncaa something like that is it just ncaa (laughs) um but (laughs) for that i think there's going to be special rules around around that because there's been a lot talked about so do we know how that could look what that's going to look like yeah from a compensation standpoint not yet um um, you know, just for example, well, first off, Notre Dame stepped out and said, hey, you know, we don't have a group licensing agreement. Um, we're not going to be a part of it right now because we don't know what that's going to look like. In the NFL, if you are on an active roster and you are in the Madden NFL EA sports game, uh, every September, based off the following year, there is a revenue share because you have a players association, the NFL players association that has a group licensing deal. So everybody gets a cut of the Madden NFL EA sports game game yep. there is no group licensing agreement um, with college players because group licensing or effectively being in a union creates an employer employee relationship yep. and that would do away with amateurism well the ncaa doesn't want that i don't think student athletes necessarily want that there are ways to make group rights happen at the collegiate level without creating employer employee relationship um, you know, that's not what we do at Icon Stores. I've talked to groups who have solutions for that. Again, I think it's just creating that first step and then moving on and seeing, hey, how can we get creative? How can we compensate these student athletes who are in this video game clearly with their name, image, and likeness? Um, and how do you keep it away from the universities? Because again, if you bring it to the universities because you're using their marks and logos, you're using the student athlete's name, image, and likeness, well, then Title IX yeah. comes into effect, right? I mean, because the football players are creating the value of that game, but if you flow it through the universities, well, then all the non-revenue and other revenue sports are going to sit there and go, well, why are they getting yep. paid, but we're not? So that's where the sticky stuff comes in. Surely there is a solution. Um, that's not what we do at Icon Source, but I would certainly be in favor of those student athletes being compensated yeah. for that.